34,000 Australians live with cerebral palsy. Max Qualia is one of them. It has affected the way he moves and the way he speaks, but it certainly hasn't affected the way he thinks. He's got a job, he's going to uni, and he's looking for an internship to further his business studies. Tonight, a special report about a young man who refuses to be defined by his disability. <laughs> Polio was born to drive. <laughs> Behind the wheel of these mammoth B double trucks is where Max is most at home. I love all the machinery. Max was born with cerebral palsy, but it was never going to stop him. One of the things that um, he used to get us to do when he was four or five years old was drive him down to the boat launching ramp so he could go down there and watch people back their trailers down the boat launching ramp and then critique them for the way that they were doing it. It was just absolutely hilarious. At 20 years old, Max has already taken so much in his stride, rising above those who prejudged him, proving how capable and determined he is to live life to the max. Because he has over the years been confronted by a variety of people who thought he was a moron, couldn't think, you know, just like wrote him off. And it's difficult enough for any young man to try to land anything anywhere these days. And if, if you have a disability, it can be an added challenge. Three years ago, Sunshine Coast family business, Clayton's Towing, gave Max a go. His dad was already working there and thought it might be the ideal environment for his boy. It was a leap of faith for everyone. So I was scared at the time. I'm just like, really? You know, like, this is not really going to be possible. Um, I've had to eat those words so many times. My name is Brian. Brian. Next thing is his truck license. Next thing he goes a semi-trial license, the next thing a B-double license. There's just nothing this kid can't do. It just, it just blows us away. Max now has the highest license you can get to drive these beasts. I got a message from Max saying that today his biggest childhood dream came true, letting somebody give him a go, and that just done it for me. Yeah. Steve is Max's mentor. Their bond is plain to see. Yeah, I do all the hard work, Max just, he does all the driving. Yeah, look. <laughs> oh, <laughs> He's got a memory I can't describe. He can remember where to move cars around. He can I give a hundred different cars to shift and he'll remember exactly where everyone goes. It's just something that no one else has a talent for. Oh, uh, it's not that hard. Max has an amazing work ethic and a fabulous attitude to life. We could all learn something from him. He's opening doors one at a time. And the inspiring thing is he's making his dreams come true. And it's not too much of a stretch to see Max running his own business one day. So as you would know, uh, with your job at Clayton, yeah. uh, which is effectively a service uh, a business. Max is into his second year at the University of the Sunshine Coast. He's doing a Bachelor of Business, specialising in subjects like supply chain management. We've seen from, from other people like Stephen Hawking that uh, anything is possible and clearly uh, Max uh, might be on the way uh, to uh, you know, also contribute significantly and maybe even in a leadership position to an organisation. I love being around all the, all the students. And what's your least favourite thing? Uh, all the work. <laughs> And on top of everything else, Max gives his time to inspire others. He's an advocate for choice, passion, life. A support service for people and families living with a disability. He is just so um, relatable and inspirational to other young people with disability um, because Max is a perfect example. If you receive the right support early in life, you can go on to achieve absolutely anything. Max is an amazing young man. And yes, he's achieved so much because of who he is. 
but he is also the product of those around him, people who refuse to see barriers, people who believe. People like Max's very proud dad. He's my best buddy, you know, I mean, he and I hang out together continually. We do stuff together all the time. Spend any time with Max and you discover that all it takes is faith. You can't just take by face value, you, you, you just really got to give people a go. Anything he does, he does it well and yeah, he's just absolutely awesome. <laughs> Hayley Francis, News.